could cut it together. We could do jump cuts. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Because it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah, three's company. Three's company is taken. Three's, three's company. company. Is it already taken? Uh, Gongo bong in the noms. Whoops. Gongo bong in the noms. This is not about you and Chen and Ryan. Bongo gong and mongo bong. <laughs> How much is your bong? <laughs> if, if it's bongo, then it sounds like a bit stoner. Yeah, but ash. Uh, ash. Ash. Ash belt. How do you spell it? Walking out of prison after 14 years away, and my thoughts turned to harmony. We were a modern day Bonnie and Clyde, best in the game. Partners in love, partners in crime, and damn good at both. It was the strangest job we ever took. $10,000 to steal a pack of cards? Only a fool would turn down a score like that. Getting the cards was easy. Trouble started when we got home. I wanted the cash. She wanted to keep the damn things. Said they were special, wouldn't let them go. We had an argument. One of them got torn, and that was it. Light in her eyes just went out. Neighbors must have called the cops. They said I killed her. As if I could hurt an angel like Harmon. Didn't get the 10 grand. I got 14 years and she got laid in the dirt. All I wanted was to close my eyes and sleep. It's the one thing I can't do. 14 years I've been locked up. 14 years I haven't slept. You're Beck Meyer. Yeah? Who's that? You don't know me, but I know you. What do you want? Come with me if you want to see Harmony again. They hadn't let me out for the funeral. No favours for a guy who kills his lover over a pack of cards. My driver was silent. I figured Harmony must have known her. She was bringing me here to pay my last respect. But I'd never seen where she was buried. But this woman had sure as hell found out. We hadn't thought about who we stole the cards from, but I guess something like that's only got one kind of owner. Powerful and pissed off. Did you hear that?